Yes, it's happening. I'm about to cut my hair. It's the last day of the year and I just want a fresh start. So my hair is a tad bit damaged because of the postpartum hair loss that I experienced, but my cut is a little bit more symbolic. It's a fresh start and I'm looking forward to it. No, this is not my first time being ultra short. I've been short once before, so I'm not nervous. I'm excited to just start my journey over and just have a new head of hair. <laughs> so what I'm going to do to make this a little bit easier on myself is go ahead and wet my hair down so that I can clearly see um, where I would like to start the cut. So yeah, I'm going to go wet my hair down. You see the back is not even like just that bad. Like right here you can see some breakage. But my back for the most part is still pretty much the same. But I can't have a mullet, so. <laughs> and this is just so I can kind of better gauge where I want to cut. Again, I want to have enough hair to grip. I think I see the spot I want to be in. Let's get it started. I'm just, I'm just going in, y'all. Here we go, here we go. I'm not pulling my hair tight. I'm just kind of breaking through it just a little bit and then relaxing it so that I can get a better, a more accurate point to cut and where I can actually still grip my hair for braids. Since I can't see back here, I may have to have my husband help me out. This is just making me so happy right now. I know it's hard to tell by my melancholy demeanor right now, but I'm very happy. So back here, I ain't gonna lie y'all, I'm kind of guessing. I'm winging this back here. Look at all this hair that's missing. Y'all know I do not go when it comes to damage, split ends, and breakage, and shedding, and all of that. Like, I'm not going, period. Okay, that looks good because this is where I kind of wanted it to meet because this was already short. So, I'm not really doing anything with this here, but I'm just going to go ahead and bring this here down and start making it even with the section underneath it. And I'm gonna have my husband line me up in the back. For those who don't know, he's a barber. So if you haven't seen my 
first haircut video where he cut my hair, he cut about five or six inches off of my hair. Um, I'll link that somewhere in this video, but yeah. I'm gonna have him go in and help me out, clean me on up. But my hair is gone. So happy. Like, I'm just, oh, y'all don't understand. Baby, don't talk about it, be about it. Period. Put up a shut up. Talk the talk or walk the walk. I just feel like right now, this is all of the weight of 2020 just falling from me, releasing itself from me. Oh, it's not releasing itself from me. I'm intentionally severing. <laughs> I am just so philosophical. Intentionality by 2020. Oh, I can't see a wig back here. I mean, the damage is done or undone. Here's the last little subsection before I'm bald. Again, this part already short, so <laughs> I'm gonna just pull that down. No, I didn't just cut any of this. This is what I was talking about. Like all of this right here, and then it just, it don't start getting long to right here where I'm pulling. So here we go. The stress, I feel it leaving my body. Cause I thought a bald head, I thought they said something. Oh my God, oh my God. Okay. Y'all. happy. I ain't even like done anything to it and I'm, I'm just ecstatic. So let's do a little styling. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm so happy right now. It's like so much weight is lifted off of me. So if y'all are new to my channel, you wouldn't know that 2020 has been one of the hardest years of my life. I just feel like this is symbolic of me letting go of all the negativity from 2020, all the sadness, hurt, pain, and just 
looking forward to progressing and moving forward and growth. Obviously my hair is gonna grow, but I just wanna grow with it and leave 2020 and 2020, baby. That's why it was imperative for me to get this done on the last day of the year. It is December 31st. I was saying, oh, you know what? I'm gonna just do it in the morning. No, no. I need to go into the new year bald. Cause it's the symbolism for me. So yeah, y'all, that sums it up. This is my new haircut, my new beginning, my new journey. I'm excited to bring you all along on my journey of just new growth, finding out new things about my hair and just really taking care of my hair how I should be. Just a fresh start. Like I, I love this cut on myself, first and foremost. I think I look good, okay? I look good i'm going to be posting hair videos and just documenting my journey and it's a fresh start it's 2021 we're going to crush these goals all of them and i feel like i can go into 2021 with a more level head because <sighs> that was all mental but it was very much necessary so yeah i'm excited about the little short hair videos that's coming oh my gosh i'm so happy but anyway thank you all so much for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already and i will see y'all in 2021 okay <laughs>